What's up guys, F minus Mike here. You guys looking for a new easy way to solo damage farm and get nearly 500 million damage without using Meta Knight or... Yo, check this out, guys. I know a bunch of you are strapped for gems and drips, so if you want an easy way to get Robux, visit collectrobux.com right now to get your free Robux. Once you get on the site, click the big blue button right here and type your username to log in. No password needed. Head over to the Earn Points tab to start earning your free Robux, guys. The easiest offers to do are the surveys found in Source 1 and also give the most Robux. This offer here, Survey Voices, pays out 182 Robux for completing it. All you have to do is click on any offer and press the big blue button to continue head over to the quest tab to earn extra free robux guys like completing a certain amount of offers you can also share your referral link guys you can earn 10 percent of whatever robux they earn as a bonus once you complete some offers cash out that robux straight to your account guys one point is one robux so you guys can buy all the drip you could ever want so go ahead and sign up right now it's collectrobux.com the link is in the description down below all right you guys asked for an f minus is delivering once again we got that trial three extreme method for you guys oh wait that's right i still don't have kuma so i can't really test out the methods for you guys so instead i'm gonna be doing a damage method six units on the bottom of my loadout guys Hopefully the goal of this game, we're gonna try to do 400 to 500 million damage using that fire rage orb and also by skipping all the waves. If you guys haven't also noticed, we don't have Meta Knight, we don't have time stop. But you guys already know the drill. Once we get that Bulma to the second or third upgrade, go ahead, place your defense unit down in the back. Uh, probably Kuma or Blackbeard six stars. It's whatever you guys want. I got a new makeover. Nah, I'm playing with you guys. Oh my, how lewd. <laughs> this is not my account. Shout out to Oka for letting me use their account. Because like I said, I, I don't have Kuma guys. So I can't really do like a trial three method yet for you guys. I can't really do all the damage videos for you guys yet. Because Kuma is like insanely OP. And not only that, Kuma is like, he's meta right now. Once you have all of your Bulmas to the max upgrade, you can see I placed all eight of them down. It's time to start damage farming. You guys know the drill already for this. Just place your light Yagamis behind this house here. And for those of you that don't know, you're new to the game. Every time you deal damage in the game, upper right hand corner of the screen, you can redeem that damage for free gems in All-Star Tower Defense. It's the best way to get free gems. That's exactly what we're doing here. So with Light Yagami, we're going to place him behind this house right here with that fire orb. Man, he's about to light this whole place up. I'm telling you right now, Light Yagami is on a different level. Let's place the first Light Yagami down right there. We're going to need to get him to that max upgrade. So we got like until the next round. But I'm going to go ahead and start, you know, doing that Erwin buff chain. We got that max upgrade. Let's transfer the buff. Use that Light Yagami. 161,000 damage. Take a look at that right there. 30.1 million damage. Can you guys imagine that? 30.1 million damage on wave 15. Yo, that's pretty dang good, guys, if I say so myself. That's why you guys definitely want to get that fire orb on Light Yagami. 161,000 damage. And if the instructions were not clear to you guys, you want to use Light Yagami's death notes whenever you see the enemies getting close to your base. So you can see my base right here. I only have 73 HP. This is it. All of the clues are coming together. I'm gonna write those names down. 44.6 million damage. You, that's our second death note. Oh my gosh. Yo, this fire orb is absolutely insane. I don't really understand, guys, but apparently Midoriya didn't learn his lesson before because we literally just wrote his name down. So we're gonna have to write it again. Let's do it right there. 48.6 million damage. All right, guys, getting ready for this next light Yagami. Every time you use the death note, just double check bottom left of the screen. You're doing 161,000 damage if your light yagami is at level 80 so let's write those names down 57.3 million damage you guys remember when i put that uh video out i think it was like four star only challenge using only uh nico robin to you know pretty much win extreme mode well would you take a look at this let's do it right there 70 million damage dude 
70 million damage. Wave 25. It does not get any better than this. Oh my gosh, guys. I swear. Didn't we just take this guy out? How many times do we have to teach you this lesson? All right, let's just go ahead and write his name down, though. Let's do it right there. 87.3 million damage. We're getting close to that 100 million damage mark. And it's not even wave 30, guys. Earth to Luffy, you're going the wrong way. If you, if you keep going, I'm going to have to use this death note. Oh my goodness. Right there, guys. 106 million damage. Let's go. <laughs> Can you guys believe how easy this method is? All we did was just put a Ghetto Irwin like stack over here. Dude, it's not even the four box, like the pro method, I guess. We're using this Ghetto method. Anybody can do this. All right, so we got Vegeta pulling up. I don't know if you guys get Vegito for completing like PvP mode and getting like champion, but we're gonna write his name down right there. 113 million damage. Continue to use all these death notes until wave 44. If you see wave 44 at the top of the screen, guys, Stop using death notes to kill the enemies. That's when you want to start placing Armin down, like, I guess, like, somewhere over here. And actually, you could probably, you know, place Armin down. He would do more damage, but, oh my gosh, there's an enemy getting close to my base. So, I'm going to go ahead and, like, Erwin buff super quick and, I guess, write his name down. 117 million damage. For Blackbeard, just place him down between waves 35 to 45. Just make sure he doesn't kill any of the enemies. Whoa. Wave 44, you can use your final Light Yagamis. I'm just going to go ahead and find like one or two of them, and then I'm going to use them right there. 158 million damage. Go ahead and start placing Kuma down. Kuma. On like the left side of this house. So I guess I'll put him like right here on the left side. I'm going to max him out, see his range, and it should pretty much cover like all the way not really the front of the map but um I, I didn't really get to place uh the irwins right but i'm gonna put all my kumos right here and then i'm gonna get that irwin buff going towards him make sure you're not using any more light yagamis we're gonna use them one more time i guess like eight more times at like wave like i think it's like 58 or like 57 when those air units from wave 56 get to the back of the map but just continue to irwin buff your troops Place your Armin's down, place your Kuma's down, and then Erwin buff them. 174 million damage, and then we still have all of our Light Yagamis we're going to use at the very end of the game. We're still skipping every single wave. We've placed all of our Kuma's down. I still have to place Armin, actually. And hopefully, we can break that 500 million damage mark. I don't know if it's possible, but we're definitely going to be trying our best. So I guess I'll place like Armin right there. Make sure you guys max him out. And then if you don't bring Armin, you can bring somebody else. You don't have to bring Armin, by the way, guys. And the last thing, guys, for Panda, look at all this drip. I got bribes in Atlanta. <laughs> Even though it looks like he's single target, you can see over here, this big circle, he's going to be hitting all the enemies. Pretty much, just wait until those air units get to the back of the map over there, and we're going to spam all eight of our light Yagamis. Ooh, 236 million damage, guys. We're almost halfway to our goal, and uh, I think we just skipped, guys, to wave 57, so those air units should be coming out pretty soon. Unfortunately, we don't have time stop. Those air units have just started coming out, so I'm going to go ahead and continue to Erwin buff. And then just get ready, guys, to use all of your light Yagamis when you see those air units get to the very back of the map. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Oh, come on, guys. That's so close to 500 million. Ah, oh, man. Nearly 500 million damage without using Meta Knight or Time Stop. For reference, the last solo damage video I did, we also got around 500 million damage, but we had to Time Stop and use Meta Knight at the same time. With this method, all you have to do is Erwin buff. But if you guys enjoyed this video or if this video has helped you out, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on those notifications. Shout out to my channel members right there once again on the screen. Thank you guys for your support. Shout out every video, by the way. Also, big shout out to everyone who's been supporting me since the beginning. We're almost at 25,000 subscribers. Hey, that's 25K. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Hopefully, 
we hit 100,000 by the end of this year. And until next time, guys, I'll see you in the next video.